What's happening guys? It's Phil here playing Animal Crossing New Horizons and I'm all jacked up on caffeine. And that has nothing to do with this video, but this Animal Crossing Money Tree Guide will show you everything you need to know about money trees. And if you're ready to get started, then please the YouTube algorithm and smash that like button. I upload videos on Thursday and Sunday, so hit the red subscribe button and turn notifications on so you don't miss the next one. I've got a lot of Animal Crossing related content that I'm sure you'd love to see. Alright, so for starters, this is not a clapping to the dodo gods or making Tom Nook blush, any kind of trick or anything like that. This is not another Animal Crossing money tree glitch, so I just wanted to kind of lay the groundwork, wanted to lay the foundation. This is a data backed guide that I've developed with engagement from the community by my own research search and some of the information was confirmed by the Animal Crossing wiki website. I'll actually leave a link in the description so that you guys can go check it out. It's a really good website. So the money tree in short is honestly it's just a, a basic form of gambling. The more money that you put in the higher the risk. Although there is a little trick to this to guarantee that you maximize your returns. Now it's likely that we all understand how money trees work but for any beginners let me run through this incredibly fast. Find the glowing spot somewhere on your island. There's a new one every day. Dig it up. Bury the money. Dig it up again. Place it somewhere else of your choice. In four days, it'll have matured fully. Shake the tree and get your money. Now the biggest question is, how many bells do you bury in the money tree spot? Warning. Math. When a player plants anything between 10 and 99,000 bells, they have a 70% chance to get three 10,000 bell bags. All right, so that means that 30% of the time, you're gonna get the exact amount that you put in in return. All right, so let's look at this from a year's time frame because I know what you're thinking. If I go ahead and do the 99,000 bells, then everything will, will kind of play out and I'll actually end up making more money. But hold that thought. So if you planted 99,000 bell bags every day for a year and with all the fancy schmancy math, you'd end up profiting an estimated total of about 4.1 million bells, which equals right at 11% profits. If you planted 10,000 bell bags every day for a year, and again with all the fancy math involved, you'd end up profiting 7.3 million bells, which is a 200% profit. Well don't take my word for it, here's the details. So that's basically saying 99,000 bells planted each day equals 36.1 million planted for the entire year, uh, which also equals 40.3 million harvested for the year. Year. And the difference between those two is basically 4.1 million bells in profit. And again, that's 11% profit. All right, so 10,000 bells planted each day equals 3.6 million planted for the year. And that's 10.9 million harvested for the year, which equals, you know, if you do the difference there between the two numbers, that is 7.3 million bells in profit. That equals out to be a 200% profit on your money. So I'm recommending that you should always plant 10,000 bells, not only for a better profit, but more so for a guaranteed one. All right, guys, it is the moment of truth. This is, this is it. All right, so I've given you the tutorial. I've told you everything that I know that I need to tell you that you need to know of how to do this. I don't even know how many trees are stacked up right here right now. I haven't even counted. I, I can't even count that high, to be honest. What we've got is a reveal, and I'm going to shake every single one of these trees and I'm going to prove to you that I've got three 10,000 bell bags in every single one of these because I've planted 10,000 bells in every single money tree hole for days. For days and days. I've been saving these trees just for, for you guys. Put the shovel away. Here we go.
all of your Animal Crossing needs, be sure to check out one of these other videos on the screen. And if this Animal Crossing money tree guide was helpful to you, then please share it with others. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel since I've got all kinds of helpful Animal Crossing related content.